if, if, if you don't get, get us renewed and you have been rooted, I mean, it's been rooted, you know what I mean, the key is to look for it we don't get, who, who is going to pass on to do the tax bill or those kind of have to really have to assume the responsibility of oh, the school system. The school system might have the kind of permission that you understand, you know, we need help that's in right. funding this particular program. That's right. Sustainability is always in our um, plans and evaluation part of it, and that's why we partner with a lot of people, and hopefully we can, through the process, we can get um, sustainability for any of these projects, and a lot of times we'll partner with somebody to enhance it, and they can take it uh, further yeah. if we're not um, funded again, but uh, like Ms. Doe said, there is a possibility for uh, a renewal. So, basically, how many children are, are we looking at helping with this? Um, the minute we're, our goal is 400 in Brooks County. Um, our numbers show that there's at least uh, 1,200 children that struggle with poverty in, in Brooks County and that are food insecure. And, and how does the work get out about your program? Uh, well, uh, through our collaborative, we have over 40 uh, 50 partners that represent every sector in the community, and there are partners as well. So, the school system, some of these um, projects that we are partnering with, like the backpack buddies, of course, will um, get the word out to the, those parents as well. The pre K will, um, both pre Ks, the Head Start and the school's pre K, will promote it for us as well for the family events, the food fairs, the gardening projects, and so forth. Okay, do you have any opportunity to see cities uh, as entities? Or like stay home moms who give their kids who, who, who need this kind of thing and don't go out. Sure, that's part of the marketing campaign. You know, our plan for part of the marketing campaign would be to um, develop some resource kits and have them at any kind of family event um, or anything. Um, people actually get tired of seeing our material, but that's the point of it. Um, sometimes somebody needs something seven times before they actually intake the information. And so our resource materials, I'll give them out to everybody. We'll have them at like, things like the Skillet Festival, uh, any kind of library event, county event, city event, anything that I can get um, that material in people's hands. So just one thing I can possibly help with, I know some of the cities like Payload, uh, they send out water bills. And maybe there could be something for water. Maybe you set something into those water bills to let people know that this this is available. You said uh, also this uh, would include our uh, head start and coach plan as well? Yes. And I apologize for talking out here. Okay. I talked over you. <laughs> so, uh, is there any more questions? If not, it's a pleasure. Good. And I make a motion that we understand approved um, to serve as the fiscal agent for the new grant from Georgia Department of Early Care and Learning. All right, y'all heard the motion. Let's see. I have a second. I'll second. I have a second. Any more discussion? All the folks say aye. 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 Aye.